Good afternoon. Today is the 16th of September and uh, it's time for yet another very vague, not very interesting and uh, I suppose a bit boring vlog. So actually we're off to the Isle of Wight today and uh, if you are a channel member on the Seat Toledo Mark IV or uh, Forever 45 V6 tiers, then you will get to see this video pretty much around the day that it's, uh, it's going to be uh, coming out. If you uh, are just a normal channel member, then uh, you'll get to see it at the same time as everybody else, although uh, you do get some exclusive content but not the very vague vlogs that tend to be anyway uh, most enjoyed by people who, um, how do I put it, uh, <laughs> sort of hardcore, hardcore viewers. So we're on the way to the Isle of Wight. My lady wife is joining me a little bit later on um, because uh, she has to do a course in Portsmouth um, this, uh, this evening. Um, which she's been doing for the last few weeks and so she's going to get the ferry over uh, to Fishbourne and I'm going to pick her up this evening but it is um, the Isle of Wight weekend a mini adventure although it doesn't look like a mini adventure at all because I'm driving a Sanyong um, but I can assure you it is a mini adventure with a group of people called West Country Minis and I've actually been uh, afforded the opportunity to drive a mini while I get there courtesy of Mr. Pink who some of you will know quite well because he was the one who bought the Yugo Sana from Mr. Ian Seabrook. Um, the Sana uh, will be appearing in a video quite soon actually I think all of you will see that video where it first appears and I've only got actually got a second video about it um, that uh, many of you might have seen by the time that uh, you see this one. So he doesn't just have that Sana. Oh, oh no, 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 no. He has uh, the Toyota Paseo uh, that uh, we had on No Budget Reviews uh, back in March. He has a huge collection of minis. He's got classic minis and R50 minis and all sorts of other minis. And, you know, some of the cars he has I can't even talk about um, for obvious reasons, but there are loads of them and he's very kindly given me the opportunity to drive one of them for the weekend. He basically uses it like a sort of storage trailer I think when he goes down to the Isle of Wight so he doesn't need it and I have sat in it, it's a, a Studio 2, I think it's about 1990. Um, well it was a Studio 2, it's not, it's not now, <laughs> oh gosh, no it's, um, it's something else rather different uh, shall we say. Um, it's been heavily, heavily modified and um, it's got a better interior, it's got better seats, it's got um, more power. I think, I don't think he's done really the brakes, you don't really need to upgrade the brakes are classic many after 1988 because they have um, bigger discs and a brake servo which it means the brakes are actually ridiculously good so yeah, I don't think he's done anything about that but I think he might have even made it ride a little bit better than they do as standard so I'm excited to actually have a go at that and I'm hoping that uh, that'll be one of the first videos from the weekend so uh, I'm probably not going to talk for much longer in this section um, I think I'm just going to I think I'm just going to actually uh, quite possibly cut until we get to the ferry port because we're on the way to the Red Funnel ferry port um, in Southampton um, and uh, I shall see you there. Right, the Honda Jazz in front of me just broke down the queue. Unfortunately uh, I was guided by very, some very kind person to uh, go in front of him so up we go. exciting isn't it this? I feel like I'm going to France or something but of course it's only an hour or so on a ferry over to the Isle of Wight. From what I've under 
stirred, there are also some minis already on this ferry. Oh, the jazz behind me has moved. I don't know what's going on. Maybe he forgot to disengage the electronic handbrake or something. Who knows? Right, he wants me to go this way. Excellent. Thank you. Here we go, here we go, here we go, go. Right, handbrake on. Apologies for the wind noise viewers. This is a uh, direction I take it that we're going to be going in. Unfortunately, I can't see um, my own car. It's just uh, sort of two behind this Nissan Leaf here. But there's one of the minis there at the front and they're just uh, boarding the last cars and then uh, it'll be off and I'll see you at the other end. Lloyd Living Consulting stickers, t-shirts and mugs are available by clicking the link to the Google form in the video description below. Looks like we're getting off the ferry viewers. Unfortunately, with the last row off, which is a bit of a shame, but there we go. Welcome to the Isle of Wight, and they've actually got a thing up here which uh, advertises Osborne House, which is which is nice, although the camera angle is not really good because that's just the way it goes on this channel, and I have to use my old mount, which uh, is the one I have to use because. Unfortunately, the new one doesn't allow me to film forward, so I've had to use the old one. But yes, what we're going to do is uh, when we get to somewhere that's sort of safe for me to stop, I will switch the mounts over and uh, we will continue over to the holiday park next to Sandown Airport where we're spending the next three nights. So viewers, we are maybe 10 minutes away from the um, place where I'm staying, so uh, just to conclude this bit of a video. I know I haven't actually answered the original question, but uh, it might be why you actually clicked on the video, and that's a deliberate thing, we'll talk about that right at the end, but um, as for today, it's uh, going to be exciting, I'm going to pick my lady wife up later on from uh, Fishbourne, not the Fishbourne in Sussex, the Fishbourne on the Isle of Wight, and um, it'll be about 11 o'clock this evening, so lots of driving around the island. Um, I don't think I'll use the, the Mini for that, um, I'll probably just use this because it's got better lights. So, uh, Mini Adventure for the next few days, some of you will have already seen the videos from it, um, some of you might not, and I'll put all those in the description below. Military road and car show and all sorts of exciting things, which uh, I hope you will find entertaining as uh, I will myself, I think. It's just a bit weird to be driving this when, uh, you know, it's all, about, it's all about minis, really, but I like coming to the Isle of Wight. And uh, to answer the question that I posed right at the beginning of, of the video, have I been to the Isle of Wight before? Why, yes I have, I grew up in Winchester. The Isle of Wight's not very far. It's about maybe 25 minutes to get to the ferry terminal from uh, where I used to growing up, maybe a little bit less where we live now. But I haven't been here for something like 26 years. It's a very, very long time. And so, uh, yes, that's it really. So, uh, I give it so much indeed once again for watching this very vague and maybe slightly pointless vlog. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more entertainment, if you can call it entertainment. Uh, like this video, leave a comment below, and uh, we shall see you soon for more pointless and long-winded rambling.